welcome to the stream. We're streaming Shark Dating Simulator XL. Yeah. Oh boy. Okay, okay. Before I do something, I need to ask something. Are we playing as a male or a female? I hope there's no sex scene. <laughs> Hello, John! <laughs> you want us to play as a female? I don't know if we're going to date a m male shark or a female shark. I hope the shark is going to be really kawaii. Yee. Let's go female. It's going to be your story, Brandy. You're the female shark around here. <laughs> I guess. You can be me. Hmm... Where... Where am I? I mean, where am I? Why the last thing I remember... It was something about... The ocean, of course! By the way, the screen seemed cut off, kinda. If only I wasn't so groggy. I think I broke a nail. Yeah, the screen's not great right now. Let's see if I can fix that a bit. No, I can't fix it. Whoops. My bad. My bad. Okay, we don't... Uh, I guess it's going to be fine like that. My bad. Professionalism, I know. Whoa. You there! Wake up and smell salt! Uh, oh, now I definitely broke a nail. What the hell's your problem? I'll have no wool gathering aboard my ship. Isn't this more of a small boat? Don't give me any of your sass, Greenhorn! Holy cow! Is this the kind of lame brain scrub who's covered with schools I'd send out these days? How is a fish scientist supposed to work with this kind of material? It's an insult to fish science! Now pay attention, you dumb slather! You're here to do a job and you better do it right. There's something mysterious going on around the sea, parts. I mean, to find out what it is. If I could swim, I'd go myself, but I can't, that's your job. Okay, enough chit chat. Get on with it. Hmm. Oh, what's with those goose look you in, Brad? Do you have a question or something? Those reels? Given the contents of your bulging eyeballs, I'm going to assume you're talking about my breasts, you little pervert. Tell me, tell you something. I'm one of the greatest fish scientists ever to science a fish. This has been my calling since I was little, and by God, I intend to walk away with the fish Nobel Prize one day. But fish science is a man's world, and I realized early on if I wanted that rice, I was going to need more than a couple of beasting dairy pillow to distract the judges. So I worked my perfect ass off, a menial fish lab assistant for years, saving to hard to get together the money I need. Yeah, she, she has totally lung cancer. And I pay the same guy who upgraded Carmen Electra to give me big, full, dreamly dactyl cans like this. In other words, I paid hard earned currency for his two solid cash. 
And if that doesn't make them real, then I don't know what does. You get me, you little shit? Yes, man. Good. Any more stupid questions now, or are you going to do your damn job? Can I bounce? <laughs> you have to be shitting me, right? You've got more chance of getting your hands on an orca scrotum than you have dodging me anywhere. <laughs> You've got some balls on you. I'll give you that. You're good. <laughs> now listen. If you were paying attention to what's going on right in Jobly's, you'll notice there's something weird going on those seas. These locals say they're dug fissure on these parts. They all say they once saw the face of Bob Hope in a prom grenade, but I, uh, but I happen to believe them one is one. Get into that ocean and find out what's going on with these fish before a harp on you through the gizzard. Find a talking one, get you alive, and bring it back. Uh, yes, sir, ma'am, ma'am, sir. Idiots. She's pretty hot when she's mad. Okay, I'm going. I'm going to try to do something. Okay, just real quick. Eh? It's not going to be pretty, and I'm sorry, but. Whoa. Definitely not going to be pretty. <laughs> okay, let's see. Sorry, the chat disappeared. Yes, I know, the chat disappeared again. And... Yes, I some some things I don't know what's going on because this game's windowed, but I guess it doesn't fit. Oh wait, no, I think I know what's going on. Whoa, no, no. No, it, this game's stupid. I don't know what to say. I guess we'll keep it like that. I'm really sorry. But oh well. The chat will pop up at the top of the screen. In fact, I'll just uh, put it under the balls. There you go. Okay, let's get going again. Alto, come to think of it, I haven't seen her being in anything else yet. Well... Better earn my pay, I guess. Here goes nothing. Sploosh. Yeah, there's no 169. I don't know why. Checkpoint. Ah, the majesty of life under the ocean wave. Now, what I have to ask myself is if I was a tugging fish. Where would I be? Hmm... Pfft! I miss Marina's dream. In, in Miss Marina's dream, that's where I'd be. Listening to a lot of old fisherman's tales, she must have a sponge of a brain. Okay, let's check my gear. Oxygen tank full. Okay, why would you check your gear after you on the ocean. No. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> oh well. Shark repellent. Check. Sandwiches. Hmm. Check, I guess. Maybe I should have wrapped them in something. Better gone on with it where 
Should I look first? Oh! Hello? Any little fishies in here? Wow, isn't that cute? Alto Sea Slug. Hello, dear little guy. How are you doing today? <laughs> Suck on my bow! Hmm? What did you just say? Suck on my balls! What the hell? Wait, you even have balls? Hmm? Hmm? Suck on my balls! Okay, okay, I get it. Fascinating. So the rumors are true. There really are sea critters down here. But how can that be? What twisted parody of nature is this? And how come I can communicate with them perfectly well underwater? Well, ain't my problem. I'm no fish scientist after all. I guess I should wa catch this little fella and show him the marina. Suck on my balls! Actually, maybe I'll look around for something better. Oh nice. As long as I don't have to suck them. I'll bet there are some choice fish inside that whole wreck over there. I'll try that! Let's see if I can get in there, in here. What do you think you're doing, Becca? Holy shit, shark! Take your grabby little human paws off my ship! It isn't for the likes of you to disrespect! Get away from here, Tim, right now, or I shall bite you hard and mean it. Oh my god! What was it me, my lecturer say to do when faced with a shark again? Yes. That's right. When faced by a murdering shark, you have to punch it in the nose. Then the shark will lose interest and swim away. Okay, you. Pick the bones out of this one. Wham! Hey! You, you nasty little goblin! Oh. You hit me. You hit my precious snout. Um. Well, it wasn't self-defense. You absolute thug! You horrible, violent little harlot! Me? Violent? You were going to show down on me. What do you expect me to do? You didn't have to hit me, you rudder! You did I did actually. What do you want? Some more? Come at me! You got the balls. Help! Someone get this ruffian away from me! Wow. I never knew I had it in me. I better split before it has a chance to get me mad about to get mad about it, though. I've seen enough for one day. Back to the boat. Huh. Safe at least. That was quite an unusual experience. Back already? I'm almost to my breast, let's see what you've got. Oh boy, I have a story for you. Story? Save it for bedtime. When you have your hideous children. I want result. I want to tell you fish. So hand it over. Oh well, I don't have one yet. What? Well, there was this shark down there. Of course it was a shark down there, you numbskull. These are infested with waters. You find donuts in a donut shop, you find sharks and shark fish in waters. But never, never do you find a shark in a donut shop. Do I make myself clear? Uh... Holy hell! And the higher in this boat has run out. Uh, I've got to take it back. 
We're coming back here tomorrow, you punk. And the extra day's boat hire is coming out of your wages. You're a disgrace of the entire female gender. Oh my god, a man could have done better. Jeez, Wiz, I'm really sorry, Marina. Hell's bells well. I suppose there's nothing else for it. We'll just have to go back to the party and come again tomorrow. I know things didn't work out so good today, Miss Marina. But I promise you won't be sorry you hired me tomorrow. I find that highly unlikely. I can't imagine anyone that associates with you does anything but regret their life choices. Starting with your mother and working down from there. Just go where I can't see you and let me pretend you don't exist for a while. Let me rediscover some, some modicum of happiness. You pie-faced tart. She does seem a tad miffed. But I'll do better tomorrow. Much better. What if I see that shark again? Well, if I do, I'll just give it another tap on the snout. Yeah, ain't no shark can mess with me. Coming back tomorrow. As I lay in bed that night, a strange question tormented my mind. Myrina was right. But how can a fish talk? What's been going on down there? Why have I, of all the graduates of Scubber School, been chosen to solve this strange mystery? Why was that sea slug such a dick? And finally, is that shark going to be around and still mad? Mad as bees? Hmm. Well, no sense in worrying about it, I suppose. Just have to see what happens tomorrow. Checkpoint. Okay, let's try this shizzle again. With suit integrity, check. Regulator correctly attached, check. Flask of coffee, check. Think I'll take a belt off that now. Just unscrew it top. Ah, shit, there it goes. Should have thought that one through better. Well, I don't need caffeine to be at my A game. Let's explore. Let's get into that wreck this time. Okay, let's see about getting in there this time. There's this door. But it seems to be wet somehow. Must be some way in. Baba. So again she returns? A bold as brass? Whoa! Explain to me what you didn't understand yesterday, Baka! I, well, I hardly know where to start. I mean about me telling you not to come back, imbecile! You dare to come back after bobbing me in the snoot? Oh, you've got a lot of nerve! You got balls. Look, I'm really sorry about that, but it was purely in self-defense. I was afraid you were going to eat me. I was going to eat you! Well, then how can you blame me? I'm really sorry I bobbed you in the snoot. I hope it didn't hurt. It looks okay now. Oh. You you think my snoot looks okay? Sure, it looks fine. Yeah. You think I'm fine? I meant... Fine as the cutie pie? Uh, sure, why not? Oh me, oh my! It's been so long. Do you know Senpai? Nobody has called me fine for years and years. They used to... Bolding side soldiers, my stepfather, drunken married men, and sea bars. I was greatly admired. I do miss it so. You see, stepfather? 
And now you come along and make me feel special again. Well, no problem. Oh, I feel a little good again. How oh, can I help you, Senpai? Well, hold on. From what you're saying, are you telling me you weren't always a shark? Of course not, silly old senpai. I used to be a sweet little maid. So what happened? Oh, senpai. You don't get a lady's life story out of her that easily. If you want to know all about me, you'll have to take me on a date. What? There's a new bar and grill just opened in half an nautical mile from here. I want you to take me there. Be there tomorrow at 7. I'll be there. I know you will. Because if you're not, uh -huh. I'll kill you. Yikes. Yeah. But you will be there, so no need to worry. Have <sighs> what fun. See you tomorrow, senpai! <laughs> desu, desu. Yeah, goodbye for now. Let us only say... Au revoir! Yay! Well, I've gotten into the scrapes before, but this probably takes the cake. Still as opposed to that it's not the worst date prospect I've ever had either. I guess I'd better report that back to Marina. Marina! I'm back! You're back and empty ended. Oh my god. I'm going to Earl. No, it's okay. I have a solid lead this time. I met a great white shark and it talks just like you say. And tomorrow, I have a ticket on the date. What the lateral fucker talking about? I'm going on a date with it. It's going to tell me what's up. I think it used to be human. You... You really are a piece of work, you know that? All I asked for was a fish that talks, not a massive flaming lesbian one. What's wrong with you? <coughs> now it starts to hurt my throat. It's like you're gonna bring back nothing at all. Or you do something resoundless retarded. Now look here, Marina. I think I deserve a little, a bit more credit here. I'm getting to the bottom of this whole fish deal. Like you wanted, I'm taking a lot of risks to do it. Just whatever, you Tim Bimbo. This means another day of boat hire. That's going to finish off the budget I had for this whole trip. You had better make sure. Don't mess this up tomorrow, it's your last chance. If you go forget again, forget ever getting paid for this gig. Forget it! Sure, she sure does love to bust my balls. You got the balls. Does that happen every time I mention the word balls? Guess not. Anyway, I better rest up and find out if wearing a cocktail dress with that wetsuit is feasible. My god, do I need money? What kind of date doesn't need money? I sure hope they accept my discover card. That night, I toss and turn. I rack my brain for what I should bring, a shark on a date. I mean, I can go without some kind of a date gift, right? What shall I bring? Hmm. Oh. Let's go romantic. Even though the flower will drawn. No girl can raise us flowers. So what if that girl's is a great big old shark? I wonder what kind she'd like. Snapdragons? Tulips? Pansies? Nah, better not pansies. I need flowers with some balls. You got balls. 
It does happen when I say balls. Balls! Balls, balls, balls! Oh, maybe not when I do it on purpose. Well, better get some sleep. Need to get up early to yoink some flowers out of the bucket in front of the 7-Eleven while the clerk's too sleepy to notice. Huh. Sploosh. <laughs> Let's see. Half a nautical mile from the wreck. If only I knew what the fuck a nautical mine was. But somehow, I reckon this has to be the place. Well, I've seen some messed up junk in my time. But this pretty well takes the shit biscuits. Yeah. Hello, Tesla boy! Papa. I thought you were going to be late for a moment here. Yeah. But you're not! Hooray! Late? As if. Ha! Hmm. Papa. Oh, she's looking at me that ways again. I think this is the point in the evening I'm supposed to say something charming. Come on, you can do this. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah. You got the balls. Do you really think so? Well, sure. He looks like, like, like rows and rows of standing knives, blade and embed in bubble gum that has been outside on the pavement for weeks. Yeah. Oh, you charmer! You always know what to say, senpai. Come on, don't forget I'm a voracious eating machine. It's eight. Oh my god. What the hell is that? He's a waiter. He's a bloodfish, right? Maybe it's in pie. Either that, or it's just preternaturally ghastly. I don't know about that, but he's an ugly fucker. <laughs> Good evening, ma'am. Good evening. Honor, ma'am. Can I show you to your rock? Thank you. Would you care to see the wine last? Oh, yeah. Perhaps, ma'am. Would care to order the wine? Oh dear, this isn't really my strong suit. Hmm, wine list. First one. Huh? We'll have the shiruz, please. Um, the Shiraz, ma'am. Yeah, some of that. Very good. Hmm. 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 Ma'am. Oh, a red wine. You're a really classy lady. I bet you broke your cherry on a great big stallion. You got the balls. Well, there was a horse involved, I suppose. But a sophisticated lady like you would certainly bring the lady a present when you took her on a date. I sure did. Got your teas. What? What are they? Flowers. Are they supposed to look like that? Oh. Maybe I should have used some kind of equity plant. Never mind. You tried. You got the balls. Yeah, I knew I should have brought the ham. Okay, senpai, let's get down to business. To defeat Hans? No, you wanted to know why fish talk around here. Is that not so? Oh yes, I guess I did. Yeah, why, madame? Oh, thanks. Well, it's a open secret, but something tells me I can trust you with it. I used to be human, and... Your meals, madame. Wait, we didn't get to order those. 
We only serve one thing, madame. Seafood. It consists of whoever the chef matters to mug in the morning. May I present the dish of the day? Suck on ma! Oh, hey, it's you again. Small world, ain't it? Is there anything else I can eat? No. If you want it, if you don't want it, I'll have it. I'm famished. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, great! That's about... Talk about me like I'm not here. Well, I'm a person too. I deserve respect. I have a name, you know. It's... Or no. Mmm, tasty! Slides right down the trap. What it tastes like. I mean, like when you awk a wicked boogie and then you swallow it again. Oh yeah, I know what you mean. So I have, so as I was saying, I used to be a human girl. In fact, I was a fish scientist. I graduated from the University of Fish Studies. Oh, no shit. My boss is one of those two. She's the one who sent me down there and work out what was going on. What's she like? Big hooters and crappy attitude. Oh yeah, she sounds very typical. All the fish scientist girls have big hooters. You won't get anywhere in fish science if you don't. Although, this was this one girl. Well laying down you could have used her for spirit level. Anyway, four years after I graduated, I became convinced that human and fish DNA were more closely linked than we thought. I got a job aboard and research vessels called the Golden Fin. In a board the ship, I start my life work, a potion that could turn humans into fish! And fish into humans! Yeah. I bet you never heard anything like that before, right, Senpai? Uh, I think I once read this movie with Aaron Paul in it. Anyway, it was highly volatile and considered a mixture. And it wasn't quite perfected. Oh. But then disaster. Disaster? Disaster! The golden fin sank. What? What happened? I don't know. Legend says the captain just didn't like it very much. But I was trapped aboard. The water was rising. I thought it was the end. But my solution tank was... I got such a high concentration of the formula, I was turned into the fish that most closely matched my DNA, a great white shark. When the formula got into the ocean, I was weaker, but I was able to convert simple fish brains into partly humans one. So now they can all talk. Yeah, that makes sense. Since that day, I have been working to recreate my formula. It's been really hard just having fins and junk. But I really think it's ready. And you have come. You can help me turn back into a real girl. Me? Please help me, Senpai. I was a hot bait. I will make it totally worth your while. Oh, you got it. Yeah. Yippee! Come on. Let's ditch the bill and get back to the golden fin. I'll race you! Okay, got it. We've made our way back to the golden fin. Here we go, sneaking around. Wow. Kind of a dumb. Yeah. Welcome to my home, senpai! How do you like it? Oh, it's very nice. Thank you! Now, without future ado, I need to help you. I need you to help me with my new batch of formula. You need me to help you figure out the complex molecular structure involved, or run my eye over the chemical composition of the solution. No, I need you to unscrew the lid. I 
got it all in there. No problem. I just can't open it. Well, I guess I could try to open it. Normally, I call her a guy for that. Don't breathe in hands, senpai. You should be okay with your skill by apparatus. Here it goes. Yeah, like a boss. Now what? What happened next, senpai? If you should prepare yourself for an amazing transformation. Say what now? She's underwater! Why would they do that there? Oh my. Oh my god. What happened? What was the blinding flash? What's the generic anime noise in aid off? Hello dear senpai! Holy shit balls! What happened? I've turned back into a human! Well, mostly. I guess it should have been a little stronger. Yeah. But I'm a lot more human than I was, right, Senpai? <laughs> hmm. Ha. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> Brandy <laughs> Brandy <laughs> Oh but you like big girls, right? I'm a tiny little thing when I'm a girl But I'm some part shark I'm sorry, I'm just a little freaked out over here. You're not quite what I expected. Uh -huh. Yeah, well, this is the whole package, sister. So get used to it. I'm sorry, Charshan. I just got. I just. I was just caught off guard. Is all. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, I can't breathe for too long the water this floor. Let's swim up to, to the beach and work what to do next. Okay. Nice to finally be back on the dry land again. Pretty sick of the ocean at this point. Smell... Smell that sea air, said Pai. Sure feels good to draw it into more than ample lungs. I can't say that again. Putting all those conversations with scuba gear in my mouth has been a little challenging. What do we do next? I'll tell you what I'll tell you what we do next and I haven't got laid since I was turned into a shot. But by George, I'm still going to make you work for it. I hope you collected plenty of balls. Let's take a look. Show me those balls of yours. Well I can't refuse that request now, can I? Hmm. Hmm. Looking not too bad there, Senpai. I believe a girl might be able to get some value for the amount of balls. I mean, I've had bigger. But yeah, I think that will do nicely. My god, I feel so objectified. Well, just wait until I get my fins on your object. But let's remember, many things can affect your fan balls. That isn't actually my field of expertise. Indeed! But I'm more thinking about actions without consequence. For example, you remember when we met for a first date? I mean that date we had like half an hour ago? I believe I recall it, yes. Well, you were very charming when we, we said hello. Even though I was in shock form, you saw my inner beauty. It was very nice of you. 
and being nice makes your ball get bigger. Yeah. True fact. Finally, we come to the times when I transform. That was the very important moment for me, Senpai. It was my big reveal. Yeah. And let me see. Let me see if I can recall exactly what you said. Oh, shit. Ah, yes. Now you must set me right if I got off pissed. But I believe the words you use were. Uh -huh. tick No, no. What I was actually saying was, uh, smell a stick? Nice try, dweeb, but no dice! And way less balls. Way less! I had it coming. Oof. Now, here's how we play. Your balls are finally going to drop. When you click the mouse, that is. And you must ping as many of my hearts as you can. And if you score 180 points, you get to have me. What if yeah. I don't? There's the booby prize for you. Oh. It won't be easy with your little tiny sack of balls. Still, you have to work to... You do have something going on, so maybe technique might save you. Who knows? Yeah. Let's do it! Oh god, it's a game. Whoa. Oh. This is a game. <laughs> this is indeed a game. I'm not scoring that 180. <laughs> Oh. I was clicking on my screen. My, my stream screen. Damn it. Oh god! Damn it! <laughs> I may have to censor that! Whoops! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, indeed. <laughs> um, I don't know if that will go on YouTube then. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Well, that's the booby prize. Oh, fiddle. I fail. Oh, doesn't that beat the shit out of everything? Howdy ho, loser. I guess you ain't getting to see any more of me than that. But don't worry yourself. You still get the booby prize. And what's that then? I'll show you. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> well, that was quite an amazing adventure. My poor boobs. I've had bites on them before, but that was practically a magic to me. Wowie. But at least everything has been brought to a satisfactory conclusion. Where the fuck is my fucking fish? Oh. Oh yeah. Oh. Hmm. Uh. I don't believe this. I am standing here astounded. Where have you been all day? Why couldn't you manage to do the simplest thing? Why did I ever trust you? You are a complete bonehead, you know that? I am aghast at what a total waste of space you are. Is that so, Marina? Well, there's something you should know.
There we go. Well, nice observation, genius. Well, you know, I never realized that. Of course I'm a massive bitch, wouldn't you be? Well, actually you are. But at least I have a reason for it. Let's set aside your witch would be reason enough for Gandhi and just concentrate on everything else. My career's gone down the pipe be just because you couldn't do the simple thing. God, I just... I just hate you so much. Wow, it's like I can actually taste it. It's like sour and the ripe cherries in my mouth. I just... I just love to see you being remorselessly pounded into a burger by some huge ape of a man my fist like sledgehammers. Good, I'm getting moist just thinking about it. Oh, I get it. Well, how about we have really, really angry sex? <laughs> that might help. Sex? With you? Exactly how much cheap gin did your mother consume while you were having... Well, we were in the womb. It has to be a lot, right? Um... It was Thunderbird, actually. Brilliant. Everything just fell perfectly into place. But well, there's nothing else for it. Like it or not, I'm stuck with you and can have running your more out of everything about my discovery. I just have to bite Daddy's ear for some more funding. Daddy? Yeah, he's rich as King Creels or and invented the hat. Made a man out of it, that whole bastard. He'll find another trip if I cry hard enough. He invented the hat? What hat? Not what hat, you think? The hat. He invented the entire concept. How old is she? Is he? 52, but what the hell does that have to do with anything? Why are we even discussing this? Going to get on the phone to him as soon as wires cash through coming back. And next time you won't fuck up. You hear me? I hear you, Marina. Like I hear the Phantom Call of the Sea. My snatch is killing me. Okay. Question. Should we go for the good ending? Let's fucking go for it! At this point, I have already a lot of censorship to do. Let's get all those balls, yo. You got balls. Let's fucking skip that shit. <laughs> oh my god. That's the... I really was not expecting a uh, this thing to happen. <laughs> I got the balls. Well, thankfully, I should have not skipped that. That was new narration. Damn it! At least you're polite. I must give you that, and you certainly have courage. You got balls. That's a lot of balls. Perhaps. I won't bite you today, but take my advice, little girl thing. Get out of fear and don't come back. If I catch you again, ooh, it will be worse for you. Now scat scat. Okay, okay. Hmm. Wow, this is the most messed up. Baka. I made it back up! <laughs> okay, okay. I've put my luck far enough for one day. It's back to the boat for me. Can't you spasmo? 
No, I mean, I can't use Basmo. Didn't I already tell you I can't swim? Well, considering you're a fish scientist, maybe you ought to learn. I did learn. It's not that I don't know how. It's these accursed breasts. They have a constant repulsive buoyancy. You mean they float? That's what I just said, good god. You're hard work. Sometimes these fabulous sweater puppies of mine are just too difficult to handle. I bet I could handle them. Shit. <laughs> nice going, mouth. Fuck you, brain. You're not the boss of me. Yes, actually I am. What the hell is wrong with you? How dare you? You insult me and just stand there drooling your to yourself. If I had the time to hire someone who doesn't have the brain cell and desperately scrolls through Tinder every night, I would, but I don't. Whatever, I'm sick of it. I'm taking her back. We'll return tomorrow. Alright, that will be something to look forward to. Hmm, wonder if I'll see that shark again. I like its little bow. Next time, I'm a little bit... I'm a little more prepared. As I lay in bed at night, strange question torment my mind. Marina was right, but how can a fish dog? What's been going on down there? Why have I, of all the graduates in school school, been chosen to solve this strange mystery? Why was that slug being... Okay, it's the same. Checkpoint. Baka. You got the balls. I'm almost... It almost made me sorry! I'm now obligated to gobble you! Oh, oh, please don't. I don't mean any harm. I just want to get to the bottom of why the, all the fish talk around here. Really? Especially you, you have such an attractive voice. Oh. You think I sound attractive? Yeah, you sound like you sound a lot like the little nurses I watch from Japanese videos. Except, you know, a bit less like you're being assaulted against your will. Yeah. Do I sound cute? Well, you sure don't sound like I expect a great shark to sound like. Ah. There's a reason for that, Senpai. I was always a shark, don't you know? It's been a long time since anyone called me cute. Usually nowadays it's just, oh my god, it's coming right for us. Or, that just, that thing just ate Brad. And, did you hate Brad? Brad tastes like meaty surfboard. But you're going to eat me now, right? I could never eat such polite fragrant lady. It would be such bad manners. Well, hold on. What are you saying? Are you telling me you weren't always a shark? Of course not, silly old senpai. I used to be a sweet little maid. What happened? Yeah, for now it's the same. Now I will bring the ham. Hello, someone that just joined apparently. Oh, it's Bean. So, Bean, you missed the part in which we're going back to. <laughs> you got the balls. We're trying to get the good ending now. Let's see. Oh, yeah. listen by. I told you to never be late for a moment there, but you're not. Hooray! Like as if. Ha! Uh -huh. You got the balls. 
You really think so? Yeah, sure. He looks like, like... Like rows and rows and blah 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 blah. Far so good, we're doing good. <laughs> I wish I was a skip button, Canada, but it's a short game. Yeah, it's okay. And here we go again. Yeah, I mean, you can't underage with that crap. <laughs> well, I think that's a perfect. Or maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> Believe me, Senpai, you don't need to be any me to make this shark succulent. But let's not get too ahead of ourselves. There are other things that factor in when it comes to your balls. Indeed. Yeah. Yeah. 45 balls to spend. We get the good ending. I swear we're going to get it. <laughs> I don't think we can get it. <laughs> Here's the sensor again. <laughs> On the next stream, let's stream Onipop. Why the fuck not at this point? I guess we can make it? Guys, I think we're going to make it. <laughs> I am not proud of myself for that. <laughs> we just need four more little thing. Oh, 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 oh! We're making it! Holy shit! At least to censor that, I guess. Let's just drop all the balls now. No! 
Now the question is, can we clear the whole grid? Because why the fuck not? I don't think it's possible. Oh. Oh. We can clear the whole grid. I'm sure we can. So the game just barely gives you enough to do that. <laughs> yeah, we cleared it. <laughs> I did it! I got enough of these little pegs. Holy crap, was that game lame. I really can't even. Maybe not, but I can. And now? So can you. But we need to decide how it is you're going to get it. I recall when we first met, you didn't freak. You stood your ground. So I guess it's time for a ride. Well, that was quite an amazing adventure. My poor boobs. I've had bites on them before, but that was pretty much a magic to me. Wowie. But at least everything has been brought to a satisfactory conclusion. Where the fuck is my fucking fish? Oh. Oh yeah. Oh. Um. Huh. I don't believe this. I am standing here astounded. Where have you been all day? Why could you manage to do the simplest thing? Why did I ever trust you? You're a complete bonehead, you know that? I have a guess at what a dull waste of space you are. Is that so, Marina? Well, there's something you should know. I just got fucked by a great white shark! Oh, lady fucking dad. Your carbon got laid by a massive undersea predator. So what? Boo hoo, poor little thing. What about me? I'll never win at a fish novel price now. I got these fake boobs put in for nothing. Look, it just all turned out to be a tad more complacent than what we were going for. There's still heaps. Of talking fish to be had. I'll go get one now. Oh no, don't be do me any favors, still hope. It's over, I give up, everything is borked. My career, my dreams, the continuity of time, everything. Oh, don't lose hope, Marina. We can't come again tomorrow. No, we can't! Don't you ever listen, my budget's all gone. Spent on three days of wordless boat hire. Would a hug make you feel better? If you ever attempt to touch me, I swear to the seven flaming demons of hell. Bugger it. I suppose there's nothing else to do but ask daddy for some personal money. Daddy? Yes, he's extremely rich. He didn't want me to be a fish scientist. It's a very sexy profession, he says. Get a real degree that will be useful in the real world, like woman studies, it'd say. But I showed him he won't like funding another expedition, but I'll just cry until he does. Guess you'll want a different school school grad then, huh? Oh no, you don't, you twerp. Painful as you are, I don't want everyone knowing about this talking fish business. The fewer people involved, the better. So you're staying on payroll until we get this right. You got me? I guess I do, Marina. Hmm. I guess I do. Yay! Game finally ready over. We did the good ending. Oh my. I will upload that on YouTube, but I will have to censor the shit out of it. Ah, <laughs> oh, table, you missed the best.
Ah, oh, I am not regretting streaming that. The Greenland shark is the longest lived vertebrae. Oh, okay, okay. Question. Would those breasts, I need to censor them on YouTube? Because there's some things YouTube kinda allow, but not everything. Like, yeah, hyper realistic boobs like Onipop, well, hyper realistic kinda. But boobs like Onipop, that won't, like, that won't make it on YouTube. That's why I censored the whole thing. But I don't know if this game, because it's like really crudely done, if it would be acceptable. <laughs> Yeah, I'll sit to them with left shark. Man. So, uh, what did we learn today? About sharks. Ugh. No, no, spend 99 cents. There's more dialogue that I didn't cover. It made me laugh. It's a funny game. As stupid as it is, it's funny. I was not expecting the sex part. But I should've. That's my bad. Damn. So, uh... Is there anything else I can do? Is there art, some spilled rings? I don't know. Yep, there is. <laughs> oh, Brandy, I love you. Hi. <laughs> Time to share that. Uh, do you want me to post Gosma one as well? Well, that y'all are stupid. <laughs> oh my god, that game. Whoa, let's uh, tone it down a bit. Yeah. Oh, I'll just post the one related to the stream. My brain can't really process. I felt like streaming something else, like another game. But I think it's a good place to stop. <laughs> oh. So, thank you all for joining. And see you once I get unbanned from Twitch. Oh.